being robbed. Are you okay? No. What's wrong? I got robbed. By who? Some guy in the street just mugged me. Are you hurt? No, he just stole all of my things. That's crazy. I need to go to the police station. Do you want me to take you? That would be great, thank you. Is everything all right? Not at all. What's the problem? Someone just robbed me. What do you mean? This guy just robbed me right on the street. He didn't hurt you, did he? I'm okay. He just stole my things. I'm so sorry. I have to file a report at the police station. Let me take you. I would like that. Are you all right? No, I'm not. What's going on? I was just robbed. Are you serious? Someone just robbed me. Did he hurt you? He took all my things, but he didn't hurt me. I can't believe that. I need to make a statement at the police station. I'll take you if you'd like. Thanks, you're very kind. Noisy neighbors. Those neighbors of mine are so noisy. Yes, I can hear them. What is that pounding sound? I think that they are hammering nails to hang pictures. How often do you hear them making noise? They play their music real loud, and I can hear it. Have you spoken to them about the, the noise problem? No, I haven't spoken with them about it. What else do you hear that bothers you? I hear a lot of plumbing sounds, like the toilet flushing and the dishwasher running. If this continues, I would speak to the manager. I am really losing patience with my noisy neighbors. They are noisy, all right. What do you think is making that sound? I think they're hammering some new flooring down in their living room. Do they usually make a lot of noise? I can hear music through the walls all the time. Do you ever tell your neighbors about the noise problem? No, I don't know them very well. Are there any other sounds that you can hear? I hear them talking loudly a lot, and their television is really loud. I would talk to the manager if the noise continues. Those noisy neighbors of mine are driving me crazy. Yes, they are very noisy. What do you think they're doing in there? Mm, someone said they are installing some countertops in their kitchen. Is there usually a lot of noise coming from over there? Whenever they play music, I can hear it coming through the walls. Do your neighbors know that you can hear them? I mentioned it to them once. Are you ever disturbed by other sounds? They have a lot of noisy parties that g get out of hand. I think that you should talk with the manager to see if he can help you. Poor area lighting. I would like to speak with the manager about some safety concerns. This is the manager. What can I do for you? I was parking my car last night in the garage area and it was very dark out there. Is this the first time you noticed this? The lighting has always been bad, but it seems to be getting worse. We are trying to save electricity, so we put in new energy-saving bulbs. Maybe that was the problem. Whatever the problem is, it needs to be fixed. Why do you feel this is so unsafe? It is unsafe because it allows people to hide in there and jump people and rob them. I will go out there after dark and check it out. Thanks for bringing it to my attention. Could I speak with the property manager about a problem I had last night? I am the property manager. What well, was the problem that you experienced? Have you noticed that the lighting in the garage area is almost non-existent? Has this been a problem for you in the past? I just moved here recently, so I really don't know how long it has been like this. Maybe some of the bulbs were burned out. All I know is that it feels very unsafe out there at night. Do you really think that... It is unsafe to have few dark patches here and there? It is unsafe because a rapist could hide in there and attack a woman. I will have the night manager look into it. Thank you for telling me about it. I had a problem last night in the parking lot and would like to speak to the manager. This is the manager speaking. How can I help you? I got out of my car in the parking area and the area was not lit very well. 
How long have you noticed this problem? This is the first time that I noticed it. Maybe you were just parking in a shadowy area. Regardless of the cause, the problem needs to be taken care of. I am not sure that having a few shadows here and there is such a problem. It is unsafe because people can't see where they are walking and could have an accident. When it gets dark tonight, I will take a look. I appreciate your concern. Recreation area problems. Could I speak with the manager about some problems in the pool area? Sure. What seems to be the problem? My apartment is next to the pool, and there seems to be some really late night partying going on out there. The hours for the pool are 8 in the morning to 10 at night. Is the noise that you are hearing later than that? Yes, sometimes people are in the jacuzzi at midnight. Did you call the night manager? No, I didn't really know if anyone was around that late. I am going to give you my number to call if it happens again. Thank you for your help. You are welcome. I will be sending letters to tenants to remind them of the rules. I had some concerns about the pool and jacuzzi area and would like to speak with someone. I can help you with that. What are you having problems with? I live right next to the pool and late at night it is really noisy out there. There is not supposed to be anyone in the pool area after 10 o'clock at night. Are you noticing people out there any later? I've heard people out there at 1 in the morning. Did you contact anyone? No, I just waited until now to tell you. I will give you the direct line to call to report this when it is happening. I appreciate your help. You are welcome. Evidently, a few people need some reminders. I was wondering if I could speak to someone about some concerns of mine with the pool area. I can answer any questions that you might have. What are your concerns? I enjoy living next to the pool, but it gets really loud out there at night. The pool is supposed to be closed after 10. Are you saying that people are partying later than that? There have been parties out there that haven't ended until 2 in the morning. Did you call the front desk? Yes, I tried, but no one picked up. You can have my personal line to call if this happens again. Do not hesitate to call. Thank you for taking care of this for me. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. We will send reminder memos to help people remember what the rules are. Asking the neighbor not to make noise. I was meaning to talk to you about something. What's going on? Were you having a party in your apartment last Friday? Yes, I had a little party. It was very loud. I didn't intend on it being too loud. It's fine if you want to have people over, but I couldn't sleep with the noise. I really do apologize for all the noise. Next time, do you think that you could keep it down? Will do. Thank you very much. Okay, and once again, I'm sorry for keeping you up. Yeah, may I talk to you? What's up? Did you have a party Friday? I did have a few people over. It was too loud. I didn't realize I was making a lot of noise. I couldn't sleep with how loud it was. I'm sorry for being so loud. Could you try not to be so loud the next time? I'll make sure to do that for you. Thanks. I would appreciate it. Let me apologize again for the noise. We really need to talk. What do we need to talk about? Was there a party going on in your apartment on Friday? I did throw a party on Friday. Oh, well, you were quite loud. I really didn't mean to be loud. I don't mind if you have company, of course, but the noise made it difficult for me to sleep. I'm sorry if my party kept you up. It's all right, but next time, could you try to keep it down? I will try to. Thank you, because that would be great. You're welcome, and I apologize for the inconvenience. Fumigation and relocation for a night. Hi, I wanted to talk to you about the letter we received about fumigating the building. 
Yes, I would be happy to help you with that. What do you need to know? Do we have to leave our apartment on the day they do it? You will have to vacate your apartment for a 36-hour period. Will you be paying for our hotel room? Yes, I will be paying for all the rooms. What if I want to stay at a different hotel? I received a group rate at this hotel, but I will pay the equivalent price if you bring me a receipt. What if I stay with friends? If you do not stay in a hotel, I will give you $50 for the inconvenience. Is there anything else we have to do? Yes, your letter also mentions what food you need to remove. Good morning. I had some questions about the fumigation letter we received. I'm here to answer your questions. What do you need clarification on? Will I have to find somewhere else to go on that day? You cannot stay in your apartment for 36 hours while it is being fumigated. Are you going to pay us for the hotel room you mentioned in your letter? The rooms have already been reserved and paid for. If I don't like that hotel, can I stay somewhere else? I got a great deal at this hotel. But you can choose a room of equal or less value at another hotel. I have my pets to think of, and I'd rather stay with my parents. You'll be given $50 for the night. What else do we need to think about? The letter also tells you about storing and removing your food. Hello, could you help me understand a few things about the fumigation letter? It would be my pleasure to help you. What is your question? Can I still stay in my apartment while they are doing this? You and your pets will have to leave your apartment for 36 hours. Are you putting us up in the hotel you mentioned, or do we have to pay for it? We will be paying for the rooms. Well, do, you, do I have a choice as to what hotel I stay in? If you want to switch hotels, just bring me the receipt, and I will reimburse you for the same amount of money that I would have spent on you. I think I might just go stay with my boyfriend. If you have another place to stay, you will get $50 for the night. What other safety precautions do we need to take? The letter you received includes a checklist that tells you how to store your food. Key and lock problems. Hi, I need to speak with the manager, please. Yes, this is the manager. How may I help you this morning? We were having problems getting into our apartment. Is this the first time that you have tried this key since I gave it to you? Yes, this is the first time that we have tried this key. Does the key go into the lock okay? It fits in the lock just fine. Let's try it one more time. Just try to gently slide the key in the deadbolt and turn it to the right. It still doesn't work. I will come up to help you right away. I'll bring another key to try. I need to speak with the manager right away. Hello? The manager is not here right now. May I take a message? Our key doesn't seem to be working in our lock. How many times have you used this key in the lock? We have already used this key successfully before. Does the key fit in the lock? It is really hard to get it into the lock, but it does go in. Make sure you're on the top lock. Put the key in and try turning it to the right. I can't get it to work. Couldn't you return to the manager's office? I have another key that I would like you to try. Good morning. Could I speak with the manager, please? I am the assistant manager. Is there something I can help you with? The key you gave us to our apartment doesn't seem to be working. Did this key work okay for you before? We were using my roommate's key before I never really tried this one. Does the key seem to be long in that lock? It doesn't really fit at all. Try putting your key in the top lock one more time and turn it to the right. It works now, but it didn't work before. We have been having trouble with that lock. I will call a locksmith right away. Roof leaking.
Hello, may I speak with the property manager, please? Hello, this is the property manager. How may I help you? During that horrible rainstorm last night, my roof began to leak. What room was the leak in? It was in our bedroom. Are you on the top floor, or is there another apartment above you? We're on the top floor. I will be sending someone out as soon as I can get hold of the roofer. Will you be home this morning? Yes, we'll be in. Fine. Good morning. If you do end up going somewhere, we can just use our pass key. Good morning. I need to speak with the property manager, please. Good morning. You are speaking to the property manager. While it was raining last night, water started leaking in from the ceiling. Was it leaking in the bedroom? It was in the living room. Can you tell me which floor you are on? We are on the bottom floor. I would like to look at the leak.、Uh, will you be home this morning? Yes, someone will be here to let you in. Just in case you have to leave, we will just use the master key. Hi, I need to talk with the property manager right away. This is the property manager. What seems to be the problem? This morning, when we woke up, there was water pouring in from the ceiling. Could you tell me what room had the leak? There was several rooms, but the worst leak was in the bathroom. Could you please remind me which floor you are on? We are on the second floor, one of the middle floors. I will be sending the assistant manager to check it out. May we look at it this morning? Actually, I have to go to school right now. If you aren't there, we will use our master key to get in and check things out. Calling the landlord to report a leak. I have a problem. What's the problem? A pipe burst in my ceiling. Why do you think that? There is water dripping from my ceiling. Is it causing a flood in your apartment? No, but my carpet is getting wet. How long has this water been dripping? It only started leaking today. I'll have someone come down to fix it、That's、right away. That's great. I apologize for the inconvenience. I'm calling about a problem with my apartment. Tell me what the problem is. There must be a leaking pipe in my ceiling. Are you sure? There's water leaking from my ceiling. Is the water flooding your apartment? It's not flooding, but my carpet is beginning to smell. Has it been leaking long? I believe it began leaking today. Someone will be right up to fix it. I'd appreciate that. Let me also apologize about the problem. I have a problem that needs fixing immediately. What is it? I think that's a, a a pipe broke in my ceiling. How do you know? The ceiling is wet and the water is dripping onto my carpet. Your apartment isn't flooding, is it? Not yet, but my carpet is wet. When did this all start? It just started today. I will send a plumber up to fix it right now. That would be fabulous. I'm sorry about the problem. Plumbing. I'm having some plumbing problems and need them fixed. What exactly is wrong with the plumbing? The toilet flushes really slowly. Are there any problems with the plumbing in the kitchen? Both the kitchen and the bathroom plumbing are are messed up. How long have you had these problems? It has been going on for a while, but just started to get worse this morning. I will send someone out to take a look at the problem. Will you be home this afternoon? Yes, I'll be home this afternoon. Fine. I will be there around two. If someone is not there, I will use my key to get in. I just moved into my apartment, and the plumbing is not working. Can you describe the plumbing problems you are having? The bathtub barely drains at all. Okay, the bathroom plumbing needs looking at. What about the kitchen plumbing? Neither the kitchen nor the bathroom plumbing is working well. Has this problem been going on for a long time? It just started happening last night. I'll be coming over to look at it this afternoon. Will you be there? I will not be home. I can always use my key to get in, but I would prefer that you be there.
The plumbing in my new apartment is not working. I need you to tell me what the problem is. The bathroom sink is stopped up. Is the kitchen plumbing messed up also, or just the bathroom plumbing? Just the bathroom plumbing. Seems to have a problem. Did this just start happening, or has it been going on for a while? Everything worked beautifully until a few hours ago. Are you going to be home so I can come by and take a look at the problem? I'm not sure if I will be home later. I will be coming by around 10 this morning. If you aren't there, I'll just use my key. Discussing a news report on a crime. Have you seen the news today? Not yet. What happened? Did you know there was a blackout last night? Yes, I heard the lights were out all night. Well, some people decided to loot last night. I don't understand. They took advantage of the blackout. They really started looting? Yes, apparently four stores were broken into. Did the looters get caught? There was no evidence of who did it. Hopefully we won't have any more blackouts. Did you see the news today? I haven't had a chance to see it. You know about the blackout last night, right? The lights were out everywhere. A bunch of people went looting last night. They what? They took full advantage of the lights being out. That's crazy. The news reported that four stores were broken into. Were the looters found? The police don't know who did it. I hope this doesn't happen again. Have you watched today's news? No, I haven't. What's going on? Did you hear about last night's blackout? Yes, the lights were out all night. Some people went looting because of the blackout. What do you mean? People decided to use a blackout to their advantage. People went out and looted? I guess they broke into about four stores. Did the police find who did it? There's no evidence of who it was. I hope we don't have any more blackouts. Discussing a robbery. Did you hear about the robbery? No, I didn't hear about it. A man tried to rob our bank today. Are you serious? Yeah, he tried to rob the bank at gunpoint. Did anyone get hurt? Nobody got hurt. That's good to hear. He did get away, though. That is horrible. The cops don't know who the guy is. I'm sure they'll catch him eventually. Have you heard about the robbery? What robbery? Some guy attempted to rob our bank earlier today. That's insane. He tried to rob the bank at gunpoint. Is everyone okay? He didn't hurt anyone. I'm glad to hear that. I heard he got away. That's not good. The police don't know who the suspect is. They'll figure it out. Did you know there was a robbery? I haven't heard anything about it. Some dude tried to rob our bank. Really? That's crazy. He tried to rob the bank with a gun. What happened? Well, most important, no one got injured. That's great. Sadly, he did get away. That's bad news. The police have no idea who this man is. They'll catch him. Discussing a lawsuit against the police. What is your case against the police? They arrested me for nothing. What do you mean? They weren't supposed to arrest me. Didn't they let you go? They didn't let me go until the next morning. So they kept you at the station? They sure did. The, did they tell you why they arrested you? I matched the description of a robbery suspect. I understand. I want to take them to court. What case do you have against the police? I want to take them to court for arresting me. I don't understand. There is no reason for them to arrest me. They let you go, didn't they? They released me the next morning. They detained you at the station? That's exactly what they did. Why did they arrest you? They said I matched the description of a robbery. I get it now. I'm definitely taking them to court. Why do you want to take the police to court? They arrested me without probable cause. They did? They had no reason for arresting me. I thought they let you go. 
Yes, the next morning. They made you spend the night at the station? Yes, they did. What was their reason for arresting you? I matched the description of a bank robber they were looking for. I see. I want justice. Talking to a lawyer. What can I help you with? I need to hire you. What do you need me for? I need you for my court date. What kind of case do you have? I'm being charged with a felony. I can help you with that. What is your price? I charge $150 an hour. I can't afford that. That's my rate. That's expensive, but I need you. How may I help you? I would like you to be my lawyer. What can I do for you? I'm going on trial. What is your trial about? It's a felony charge. I'd be glad to help. How much do you charge? My rate is $150 an hour. That's highway robbery. I don't know what to tell you. Okay, you're hired. What can I do for you? I'm in need of your services. What do you need me for? I have a court date coming up. What are you being charged with? It's the felony charge. I'm willing to provide my services. What's your rate? I work for $150 an hour. That's too high. That's what I charge. I'll hire you anyway. Filing a complaint at the police station. What may I help you with? I need to file a complaint. What is your complaint about? I got robbed. When did this happen? It happened this morning. What was taken? My wallet and cell phone. Did you get a good look at the person who robbed you? I sure did. Would you be able to pick him out of a lineup? That shouldn't be a problem. May I help you? I want to file a complaint. What's the problem? A man robbed me today. When? I was robbed this morning. What did he take? He took my phone and my wallet. Did you see his face? I saw him perfectly. Could you pick him out of a lineup? I could do that. What can I do for you? I would like to file a complaint. What happened? I was robbed. When did this happen? It happened this morning. What was taken from you? My wallet and my cell phone. Were you able to get a good look at this person's face? Yes, I was. Would you be able to pick him out of a lineup? That would be easy. Being arrested. I don't understand why I'm being arrested. You have a warrant. A warrant for what? Apparently you have a bench warrant. What does that mean? You missed a court appearance. I wasn't aware that I had to go to court. I don't know what to tell you. I don't find this fair. Life isn't fair. Don't I have any rights? You have the right to remain silent. Why are you arresting me? There is a warrant out for your arrest. What kind of warrant? You have a bench warrant. What is that? Have you missed a court date? I never went to court. I can't help you. This is unfair. A lot of things aren't unfair. That's life. I have rights, don't I? You have the right to an attorney. Why am I being arrested? You have a warrant out for your arrest. I don't have a warrant. My computer shows that you have a bench warrant. I don't know what a bench warrant is. You apparently missed a court appearance. I was never told to go to court. There's nothing I can do about that. This isn't fair. That's life. What about my rights? Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. Pleading not guilty in court. Order in the court. I would like to make my plea. What is it? I would like to plead not guilty. You do realize that all the evidence points to you. I know, but I did not do it. How do you figure that? I didn't commit the crime. Do you know who did? If I tell you who did, will you release me? I'm sure we can work out some kind of deal. I'll tell you all you need to know.
Order. Your Honor, I am ready to make my plea. What's your plea? I am pleading not guilty. But all the evidence points to you. I am not the guilty party. What are you saying? I am not the person who committed that crime. Who is? Will you let me go if I tell you? We can work something out. I have no problem singing like a canary. I need order in the court. I am ready to make my plea. What do you plead? I plead not guilty. All the evidence indicates that you are guilty. I realize that, but I am not guilty. Is that right? I had nothing to do with the crime that was committed. Who was the guilty party? I'll tell you if you let me go. I'd be glad to make a deal with you. I am willing to tell you that information. Being set free. You're free to go. That's great. What are your plans now that you're getting out? I want to go back to school. What is your major going to be? I haven't decided yet. I hope I don't ever see you back in here. I'm never coming back. This really isn't the place for you. I realize that. Good luck out there. Thanks. Things are going to be different now. You're free to leave. I'm so excited. What are you planning on doing now? I'm going back to college. What are you going to major in? I haven't thought about it yet. I don't want to see you back here. You won't see me here again. I don't think this place is for you. I know. I wish you luck. Thanks. I know things are going to be better. You're all set to leave. I can't believe it. What are your plans? I plan on going back to school. What will your major be? I'm not sure yet, but I plan to do good things. You don't have plans to end up back here, do you? I have no plans on being back. You don't belong here. That's true. Good luck with your life. I'm going to be fine.